Hello there, my name is Plumby, and today I am going to be bringing you a custom content haul for June. I don't have a ton of custom content to share with you today as I didn't find a lot on my CC shop, but per usual, all the custom content which I did find, I really did love and I can't wait to use this month. Per usual, all the custom content links are going to be linked in the pinned comment in the comment section and everything I will showcase to you today is also reblogged on my CC Finds Tumblr which I'll have a link for in the description box. Beginning with the hairs, I have this hair here by Daylife Sims. I really, really love this hair. It is so, so beautiful. It's just very lovely braids. I have a few more hairs by Daylife Sims. This one here is one of them and it is so cute. I really love the fringe. I love the pigtails. I really love this hair as well. I, once again, really love the fringe. I feel like Daylife Sims really does a good job at like capturing the style of specific hairs. Like I feel like they know exactly what they're going for and I feel like they really do present it really well and yeah I always love their CC, the hairs are absolutely beautiful and they never fail to blow me away, I love everything that they do create. Next I have a few hairs by Okayo starting with this one here, I really really love this hair, I love how it's kind of you know curly at the front, the fringe is like curly but the kind of bun has more of like an afro texture, I really really love that. And I also love this braided bun here. This is very, very beautiful. I love Okayo's hairs. They're always so lovely. Next, we have this one here, which is also really, really pretty. I really love the plait that's kind of going on there. We have a side ponytail, which is also very, very pretty. I really love side ponytails. I think they are so lovely. So I really love this. I really do like the bandana on this hair. It is very, very adorable. And I also love the two pieces at the front. I believe the hairs that I'm showcasing here are part of a like hair pack that Okayo did. So I'll probably link them in the same number. And lastly, I have this hair here, which is so pretty. I love how it's kind of, you know, grabbed the front pieces and kind of tied them at the back. It's very, very pretty. I really, really love this hairstyle. Next, I have a hairstyle by Twisted Cat. I really, really love this hairstyle. I love the bows. It's so adorable. I think it just looks so fun and it also comes in a version without the bows and just with the like headbands if you'd prefer that. I, not the headbands, sorry. The elastic bands, the bubbles. <laughs> Next I have two hairs by A. Harris O. Brittany, starting with this one here. We have another bun. I think it is so lovely and I really, really love the kind of two pieces that are at the front of the hair. And we also have this hairstyle here, which is two pigtails. I love these. I think pigtails are so freaking adorable. So I love that I have some more hairstyles like this in my game. Next I have this just like kind of long straight hair by Kira Zerk. I really, really love hairs like these because it just looks like my sim has just brushed their hair and to me that's really realistic because obviously not all sims are going to have the time to like style their hair so I prefer these more realistic hairstyles and I just I really love how this one looks I think it is very very flattering. I have two hairs by sims trouble starting with this one here this is basically just a very very beautiful plait I absolutely love it. It's a gorgeous long plait. It's so, so, so gorgeous. I absolutely love it. We also have this really cute bun here, which is kind of tied up with a claw kind of thing. I think it's called a claw. I'm probably incorrect, but you'll have to let me know in the comment section down below. This comes in a couple versions. This is version one, two, and then three. Next, I have a hair by Arthur. This one here, this is very, very adorable. I love the kind of braided look that it has. I think it is very, very flattering and I really, really do like this. And lastly, I have two hairs by Nolan Sims. This one is the first one and this one is the second one. I really love this and there is an accessory to change the color of the headscarf if you would like to. Both of these hairstyles are so, so pretty and yeah, I'm a big fan of what kind of Nolan Sims did here. I think it's a very cute look. I love the headscarf. I only have three things in the makeup section to show you today. Beginning with the eyeshadow, I have this eyeshadow here by Trilogy. This 
is a very very sparkly very very shiny <laughs> eyeshadow sorry i'm not explaining it very well but i really really like this do you ignore my sliders being broken i need to update the ui cheat mod or the co more columns mod but yeah i really like this i think i'll probably mainly turn down the opacity with it just to give it more of a kind of max is matchy look this is a very very lovely eyeshadow and perfect for your sims party wear and by vanilla sims i have this kind of smoky eyeliner and i can never get enough of eyeliners in my game so i really like having this and lastly i actually have some eyes here now these eyes don't only come in the face paint section they can also be default and non-default but I thought I'd give them a go as I've been kind of experimenting with my sims eyes lately I want to find a new default eye so I got these ones here by Twisted Cat and I actually really love them I think they are very very beautiful they're very different to the eyes which I have usually used I'm usually a very strictly max's match person so they need to look almost vanilla but I don't hate these I think I'd probably you know make them a bit smaller give them that more realistic look but I'm actually quite a big fan of these and I'll definitely be kind of testing them out on my other sims i have two earrings to share with you today first these really really cute embroidery earrings by nolan sims these are the absolute cutest i adore these so much they are so freaking adorable and i can't wait to use these these are so cute <laughs> I also have these bow earrings. I'm not actually sure who these are by, so I really do apologize, but these are very, very adorable and I'm really looking forward to using them. Now on over to the tops. I only have two to show you today, but I still really like them. This one being the first, I don't have a lot, so I do apologize, but this was created by A. Harris O. Brittany. I really love this top though. It's so cute and it also comes in a patterned version as well, which I always love. I love the patterns that this top does have. They are very, very lovely and I can't wait to use this. And lastly, I have this top here by Trilogy. I really love this. I first of all love the pattern, the kind of leaves on it. It's very, very pretty and I love the swatches and the texture looks really lovely. I can definitely see myself using this a lot. Now on over to the bottoms. I also have two bottoms to show you today starting with this one here by a harry so britney just a denim skirt love the denim swatches that it just does come with and it also does come with an option with a belt now on over to the full body i have this dress here by adrian pastel this kind of actually reminds me a lot of like a 1960s dress i really love this love the swatches it has a very vintage feel to it which i really love i have this lovely summer dress here by demonda sims i really love this i am very excited to be using this now it is summer i know it's technically not summer yet because it's not the summer solstice yet but it's been really really warm and sunny over in england so i'm just going to say that it's summer <laughs> So this is perfect for that and I really love this dress and all the swatches that it comes with. I have this really cute romper, I think it would be, by Nolan Sims. I really love this. Once again, extremely summery. I absolutely love the pattern swatches this comes with as well. Next, I have this dress by Madame Ria or this pinafore. I really, really love this. It's actually quite autumnal, which I love autumn. So I do love this and I think it is very, very fun. Love Loving the swatches as well. I also have this pinafore as well by madame maria i really love this once again it's reminding me a lot of autumn i feel like it's also got a kind of vintage feel to it which i really love and lastly i have this kind of also a romper would this be a romper i'm so very sorry if i'm calling everything the wrong <laughs> name but this is by mossy lane and this has to be one of my favorite things i got today i just love it i love the swatches i love the little flowers on it i love how it's like denim i just think this is so adorable and i cannot wait to use this on my sims i hope you liked all the custom content which i did share with you today as i did say i didn't find a lot this time around when custom content shopping but I cannot wait to use all of this custom content in my game. As I did say in the beginning of the video, if you are interested in downloading anything I just showcased, all of the custom content is linked in the pinned comment in the comment section and it is also all reblogged on my CC Finds Tumblr, which I have a link for in the description box. As I always say, I hope you're taking care of yourself today and doing something that brings you joy, even if you are only doing it for a minute or two. I'm sending you lots of hugs, hot chocolate, coffee or tea, whichever you prefer, and I hope you have a very, very, very wonderful rest of your day.